Ruta AC, or the Citrus family. Characteristics of this family is that there is 150 to 158 genera and 900 to 1,500 species. Most species are trees or shrubs, while a few in this family are herbs. Most are aromatic with glands in the leaves that release the citrus scent, and some species even have thorns. Leaves of these plants within this family are opposite in compound, meaning that there's more than one leaflet in a leaf, and that they stem oppositely coming up the stem instead of coming out from the same node. Uh, the fruit of the Ruta AC family is very variable. There's berries, droops, capsules, and follicles. The citrus genus has around 300 species. It's commercially important, as I'm sure you can tell, because everyone has had a citrus fruit. Uh, the large citrus fruits of today have evolved from small edible berries, which is very interesting to think that something so small can evolve into something so large. Um, every citrus fruit has been hybridized from one of the three main fruits, which are the mandarin orange, the plumello, or the citron. The juice is also known to have a high quantity of citric acid, giving them their sharp flavor and their high vitamin C content. And while you can find these plants all throughout the world, they're native to Southeast Asia, and were first introduced to Europe around the time of Alexander the Great, and introduced to the Americas by the Spanish. The Brania genus has about 100 species. They are known for their scent, especially the species Brania megastigma. Unfortunately, they're hard to grow in cultivation, and thus, to be noted, you mostly have to see them in their native habitat throughout Western Australia. Interestingly, the town of Brania Victoria in Australia is named for the plant because of how densely populated it is in that region. The genus Xanthoxylum has about 250 species, most of which are used as bonsai because of how they grow in temperate climates and how easily they can be grown indoors in a pot. Historically, they have been used for toothache, which is how some plants such as the toothache tree or Xanthoxylum americanum has been named. There's also plants such as Xanthoxylum parvum that have interesting common names, such as this one being called Shiner's Tickle Tongue. The Melancope genus has about 230 species. In Australia, they are known as doughwoods or corkwoods. In Hawaii, they are known as alani. While they are used as ornamentals throughout all tropical regions, they are only native to Australia and Hawaii. And while many of them make nice sap, the nectar of Melancope harangini is known to yield toxic honey that can kill all who eats it. The Agathosma genus has about 140 species and is native to the southern part of Africa. While the name of this genus literally means good fragrance, there is differences in perceptions of the smell among people. Most people find it to smell good, but some people are repulsed by the smell and can even be shied away from going into an area where it is known.